a day after, you know, first game in two weeks, how are you feeling? Uh, fine. Yeah, just looking forward to getting a win, uh, helping the team win. Uh, we came here to win one, maybe two, and uh, we still have an opportunity to win one, so we got to play a lot better than we did last night. Specify who you're asking to, please, Pierre. Uh, maybe for Dustin, uh, what do you guys need to do early, especially in the, in the game here? Just obviously, not a lot of offensive zone time last night. Yeah, we got better towards the third period. Obviously, it's a cliche answer, but we got to play the last period like we did for 60 minutes. You know, they came out and had their way with us in the first. So we got to make make them go back, make their D go back, get bodies on them, and make them work to get out of their own end. Jared, do you guys feel like you were maybe chasing the puck a little too much last night? Uh, yeah, like uh, Penn just said, just no ozone time, no sus you know suspended uh, time in their zone. Um, lengthy shifts, three, four shifts in a row, we just didn't have that. And, uh, didn't make Crawford work uh, nearly as, as hard as we wanted to. Dustin, Brian Bickle said this morning that he modeled his game after you. Uh, what do you see when you watch him play? Yeah, he's improved over the last three, four years. He's a big guy. I remember him breaking into the league when I was in Edmonton. And uh, that's, uh, you need big bodies and competitors in playoffs, and I think that's what he's brought to their team. Anybody else? Pierre? Uh, for either one of you guys, do you guys uh, feel like this uh, game might get a little more physical to be based on those last couple hits in the final minute yesterday? Yeah, I think so. I think we, we got to bring more of a physicality to the game than we did last time. You know, they were out on the perimeter pass, passing pucks around, and we got to go through more of their players more often and make it tougher on them. Uh, maybe, Jared, any thoughts as to why the team has struggled on the road this spring compared to a year ago when you couldn't lose on the road? It just seems such an extreme from one year to another. Yeah, it's, it's a weird thing. Uh, I don't think you can pinpoint one or two things. Uh, it seems like our offense on the road has, has struggled, um, scoring one goal or you know, not more than two. Um, I don't know. I don't know what that is, but uh, we've got to find a way to win some games on the road. And if we want to keep our season going, we know that. Um, you know, good chance here tonight. Jared, Chicago found success results yesterday when they were able to crash the net, get those bodies in front, and, and also on a rebound. For the centers, is there any more of a concerted effort to make sure that Quick sees all the shots to be able to clear traffic out in front? Well, we know that's going to be a game plan uh, of any team we face now against our goaltenders. So that's a job on the low, the low forward and the two defensemen to yeah clear guys out, make sure that Quickie can see those pucks. He battles to see a lot of pucks anyways, but. You know, just to make sure that there's no second chance opportunities that they're going to get a stick on, um, they're going to be able to make uh, second chance opportunities out of. So, yeah, it, it's a job of everybody in the D zone to to help out that way, especially around our net, um, make it tougher on them. If they're going to get shots from the outside, that's one thing, but after that, it's uh, you yeah, know, that's it. Uh, for either of you, is there any difference in playing the back to back when it's on the road when you're playing two games, and as opposed to you know, having a, a day off or is it just the same for both teams? Well, the amount of time that elapses between games is less. Um, we've played back-to-backs before. For us, it's nice because we get a, qu a quicker chance at redemption. You know, you don't have that time to dwell on it. Uh, we went over a video, didn't skate this morning. And the playoffs is the time you just yearn to play the games. You know, everything else, the, the media, the practices, the time between games. You don't care for it, but when you're on the ice, it's the best part for us.